Not cool, dude. Not cool. <laughs> Black Friday. We just stopped to get some food and uh, in and out if you guys are familiar. People love in and out We enjoy in and out We're not like crazy about in and out like a lot of people, but uh, we still we still enjoy it. So uh, we got ours protein style, which means there's no bun, just lettuce. Justin ordered his mine? protein style like 12 times. Cassie likes to make fun of me sometimes. And, <laughs> and I, I was unclear as to how to order it. Because the thing about in and out is there's like a secret menu that's not on the menu. And you have to know the right words to say. And I don't know the right words. And so she was she was teasing me. But she'll pay for it. Yucky. You tried to murder me, hamburger. Not for me. Oh, we got baby jo Oh, you got one protein style. Yeah, and then uh, Baby Johnny got a grilled cheese. Well, he is he okay with the tomatoes and stuff in the grilled he cheese? He likes tomatoes. Uh, he likes lettuce too, so I don't know. Nom 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 nom. Yum 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 yum. You look so cute when you eat. <laughs> is that yummy? Oh, you forgot your mat. Oh, forgot my lap mat. Lap mat. Need my lap mat. You need this. There we go, lap. there we go. That way my lap doesn't get dirty. It is so messy, but so delicious. So delicious. You gotta get the extra tomato. Just makes it like scrum diddly umptious. Mm -hmm. What do you think? So good. What do you think, dude? Yummy? Mm -hmm. That means yeah. it's yummy. He wants more. Yummy. So the past couple years uh, on Black Friday, we'll hit stores at like 1 p.m. on Friday. Thinking that there's gonna be crowds and thinking, you know, because usually around Christmas time, you know, there's a lot of crowds and stuff. Black Friday, especially, there's supposed to be, you know, a lot of people out. The past few years, like around noon or one on Black Friday, it's been pretty dead. Like right now, there was no line of in and out. The streets are kind of dead. Uh, but I read a news report saying that uh, Black Friday sales are like amazing today, so that's that's good. I mean, as far as financial figures, like they're a lot better than what people expected them to be. So we're gonna hit some stores up and uh, see what's around, see if there's crowds, see what deals are out, and uh, we've gotten some great deals even late in the day on Black Friday in the past. Yeah. Um, let me show you something. Do you wanna see something? Yes. Like, okay, if you need, if you don't have like a machine to hold your ketchup for you, look, I have an invention for you. Just open it up all the way, oh, that's a poor example. This is a better example. You just open it up all the way, and then it's like, it's like a, like a holder for your ketchup. If you prefer like to just like have a holder for your ketchup, I just created one for you. I am an inventor. I keep getting stuff on me. See the birds? Say hi birds. You caught me tomato hand. <laughs> mm -hmm. Tell a bad joke so I can throw this at you. Not cool, dude. Here's your tomato. He doesn't want the fries or the cheeseburger. He wants <gasps> the bird, uh-huh. He wants birds and tomatoes. Yeah, he's gonna be really disappointed that when he learns that chicken is actually a bird. <laughs> You're gonna That's be sad, funny. huh? It's gonna be a sad day. He'll he become a vegetarian. Birds so much. Buddy, look, birds! No, they're, these are some sad pigeons, but they're kind of fat because they live next to In-N-Out. Can, do pigeons eat? Should we create a bird? No. Please? No. They like Should we create a bird? Uh, I mean, should we create like a, like a no, all bird the pigeon, moment? No, all the, all the pigeon lovers watching, all the pigeon lovers watching. You were really close. <laughs> all the pigeon lovers. All the pigeon lovers watching are going to hate you for this. But they, but I thought, it's better than them eating. Oh my gosh, bird frenzy. What do we got here? What do we got here, birds? This is for you, baby. You wanna see all the birds? This is a present for my son. Well, they're trying to catch it midair. How crazy would it be if like five of them flew in here? Oh, well, I don't want that to happen. <laughs> all the pigeon lovers hate us right now. I'm sorry, my wife fed the pigeons. No, I'm They this really is for shouldn't my eat baby. bread. Someone's gonna feed them bread if Whoa, don't come in here! <laughs> that is freaky. Um and they all live next to In N Out, so they're eating like second hand bread. This is like fresh stuff. They're not eating like pigeon seed. I can guarantee you that. No, so Ow! Oh, I just ran that class. Why did you betray me? Someone comes out here with pigeon seed. We're at Walmart for Black Friday. So the 
past few years we were able to get great deals on movies and they're like two to five dollars for like awesome movies so like all of our yeah um, just like Barney and friends meets the zoo I don't know <laughs> good day zoo <laughs> I don't know but they were act like actual good movies like like 300 and the last samurai like stuff like that so um, this is obviously a few years ago yeah oh, where did you come from um but hopefully we can find some good movies and then we can give all our friends these nice gifts but don't tell them it only cost three dollars just kidding i just want to see the movies that's really all i'm here for and hopefully we'll find some other like the best bargains are like the only sort of good bargains that no one wants they all want the flat screens not us we're realistic i know they only have three flat screens in the whole store for the cheap price so i go there for the movies oh my goodness look at that car that car wants me to own it what do you want to find in there I want Teddy to Grahams. The movies. the movies are sometimes pretty good. Yeah. Check that out. Oh, oh, and Cassie's Cummins coming over. Cassie's cousin is coming over for dinner. This is Steven, the guy who told us to do a podcast once ago. And he was his voice was on the first our little podcast episode. And he's gonna come over for dinner and I want you to meet him. He's cool. Oh, and let's get a big panda and unstuff it and make him do the panda dance again. Nice. <laughs> nice. If I if I have the panda dance, I'll insert it right here. If What do you think of Black Friday, buddy? What do you think? We got a movie and all the dressings to make some cheekies, 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 like a cheeseburger egg rolls for my cousin and my cousin's better half. <laughs> I don't know what people say about their spouses. She's my better half. They yes, do yeah, they do. That was another rhetorical question. You answered me. <laughs> It's a storm, a windstorm. My favorite thing about uh, Black Friday is, uh, uh, dude, I saw like five or six men explain to their wives why they needed certain things. Like there was this basketball hoop, and he's like, honey, listen, it's like seven feet tall, but then you can make it 10 feet tall, which is regulation, and you know, the kids can play it, and we should just really get it because, you know, and that has their favorite team, which is the Lakers on it, or whatever, and, and they just need to, or like the TVs. And then I had to tell you, no, you don't play basketball. <laughs> <laughs> the TVs are like, honey, I know we've got six LCD TVs, but this one, the DPI is so much greater and the processing is so much better. We just need this because, because see, we can hook the Netflix in and it has a YouTube app, so we could just, hilarious watching people justify these purchases. I mean, you know, a lot of them have good arguments, but it's just hilarious watching them. Uh, <laughs> I just peed a little. I just tinkled. I don't even know what that was. Did you hear that? It's a choo choo trick. Dude, I freaked out. I was like, ugh. Ah, ah. I know, I did the same thing. You oh did? my gosh, twin sisters. Love sisters. Your life. Sisters. Lifetime in love. Sis Can we just be a lifetime in love? Yes. Just like lovers paradise? Yes. Everything's creepier when you say it's for lovers. <laughs> it's, it was, did you have fun on Black Friday? This is the funnest Black Friday. We just got the deals. <laughs> Made some We money. bought a DVD and groceries. Yeah. <laughs> That's what we did. And then we got to witness all the people who are still out in their jammies. Oh, their jam jams. Oh, their little patch maze. Their peanut butter and jams. Oh. <laughs> that little girl like, she was looking at you like, is this guy doing? What is this guy doing? Why is he like eyeballing that camera like that? Yeah. Oh. Steven has a pie. It's a nice pie. Steven has a pie. You guys met Steven on our podcast, our very first podcast. I'm gonna put my arm around Steven. Hi. This is Cassie's cousin <laughs> Steven. He's the one. He's the one that told us to do the podcast. Thank you. Thank it's you. thanks to him. <laughs> Thank you for that. You're welcome. He did the panda dance. And he did the panda dance. Do we have that video clip? I'll find it. We'll find it and we'll insert it. Full size panda bear. Full size panda bear. There was a, a helpless stuffed panda that he murdered, gutted, <laughs> took the stuffing out of, and then became one with. That sounds really weird. <laughs> I don't like that. It was. But we invited uh, Stephen and Shayla over for dinner, 
and they brought dessert. We did bring dessert. They brought dessert, and St Shayla just went missing. I don't know where she is. She just she just went hiding. But it's apple pie, and then they brought some vanilla ice cream. So we're really excited about that. I almost forgot something very important. You guys know the song that Cass and I always sing? Drink that drink like a post do. Drink that drink like a post do. You hear Steven laughing? Drink that drink like a post do. Like your daddy, like like your daddy taught you to. I don't even know my own song. Dude, the first time that was sung, it was with this guy. Hi, how you doing? Nice to meet you. <laughs> it was with him the very first time. Thanks to him, that song was birthed. Drink that drink like you post. Dude. He's the one. The He's the one. He's the one. Steven and Shayla know how to bring pie, man. They brought the pie. Is this homemade? Did you make this? I, her aunt made it, but we, we kind of regifted. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> you regifted a pie, so someone else ate this, and then you put it in pie form. Uh, no, it was just brought to us, and then we brought it to you. So, kind of both. I don't know. It's it's for first time eating though. Okay. So no one actually ate it. It's okay. It's okay. Well, thanks guys. Eat that pie like you post to. Eat that pie like you post to. Eat that pie like you post to. Just like your daddy taught you. Just like your daddy taught you too. Sing it. Oh, you do your Christina Aguilar. I can't. I'm do it. Just say it like embarrassed. your daddy taught you to. Do it. I can't. I'm Do it. Do it. <laughs> I'm embarrassed. Like your daddy taught you. <laughs> you. I have to put my pie down. If put your pie down. Sing, sing it. Sing Eat that pie like you're supposed to. Eat that pie like you're supposed to. Eat that pie like you're supposed to. Like your daddy taught you to. <laughs> Cassie does the best Christina Aguilar impersonation. So you guys know that though. Not only did he bring a pie for us and ice cream, but he's leaving it here with us. It's pretty exciting. Yeah, it's pretty good. I'd story. hug you, but there's a camera in front of oh. me. <laughs> you didn't know there was a camera in front of me, did you? I ate the whole pie. Yeah. You're so fat and disgusting. I know, I'm sorry. Yeah, don't show my wife the one who really said that. Just kidding. Um, do you want some of this? I do. Ah, ah. It's like our wedding day. It's just like our wedding day. Oops, let me get that. <laughs> that wasn't awkward for me at all. Eat that pie like you post to. Eat that pie like you post.